Hi, pretty girls, how you doing? Today we're gonna to do another bigger card, and it's gonna be how do they feel? Uh, we've done that in the past. That can be triggering. Stay cool, okay? Maybe not what you expect. We could be surprised actually as well. Um, it doesn't have to be, um, you know, the you two being separated. Sometimes you can live next to somebody and not really knowing how they feel. Okay, so stay cool. It's just tarot, as I like to say. And just let's keep an open uh, mind and heart as well, I was going to say. Ooh. <laughs> okay, don't start, I said don't stop. Okay, right. One, two, one, two. Part number one, how do they feel? The Empress, Nine of Sword, the Child. Ooh, well, well, well. They're very anxious. That's how they feel. They're very anxious, wondering um how that is going to work out because what they want to do is actually move toward you and it's physically uh very much a traveling toward you the child is generally an idea of traveling um, but it's also the intent they have it's really victorious i want success you know i'm not coming in to have a cup of tea and a biscuit what's the thing with me and cup of tea and biscuit <laughs> Never mind. Uh, they really have strong motivation, okay? But because they're just about to do that, they're wondering. They're wondering how am I going to be, you know, um, received? Uh, how am I going to sort it out? How? What am I going to say? How? 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 And why? I mean, the why is very straightforward. To be fair, <laughs> they're super motivated because they recognize you as the empress. You are, I mean, male, female doesn't matter. You're four queens in one, which is you know extremely powerful so they have reason to worry because they have in front of them someone that really tick all the boxes someone who's very strong but also very loving and caring someone who went through enough because you you know born an empress you become an empress through a lot of you know tribulation so they know that you've been through enough um in your life in general and maybe with them as well so as a result, you're very strong, but also they don't want to add more trouble. So they're very respectful towards you. They just hope that they're going to be good enough for you. And that's why they're so anxious. They can't sleep well at night. It's a little bit tense for them. Okay, so let's have more information. Yes, they're not sure how you're going to receive their offer. Mm -hmm. Maybe they wonder if you're ever going to actually perceive them as a potential a lover, potential person in their life. They're not sure at all. Mm -mm -mm. Yes, they had to go through a purge. They also want to clarify a lot of things. Maybe what happened in the past, um, you know, never had any follow-up. So you never had a face-to-face -face explanation. You never had a proper conversation about what happened or what didn't happen. And it's time to clarify. Judgment as well is, yes, there might be simply a judgment from you and they're afraid of that judgment. You're going to make a decision, yes or no. It's going to be straightforward. And they know you have the capacity to do that. You can be like, that's it, you know. Mm -hmm. Yes, they're trying to build on uh, maybe their money to make sure that they, they knew exactly where they were standing. The king of pentacles, male, female, doesn't matter, only has one companion one partner and also that is an idea of uh, behaving properly doing the right thing and maybe they're trying to do the right thing and decided maybe to stay with somebody they used to be with but they realized they got it wrong and you are the empress and that person wasn't so now you know they feel uncomfortable with them, themselves because they made a mistake they so they knew that person and they got it wrong for example, you know, a scenario like this. Yeah, they had to drop something. I have a feeling there was somebody else. Um, they had to drop something and maybe drop someone, drop the fear, drop the um, preconceived idea of what love should look like. We think it's like, yeah, the charming prince and the princess and the blah, blah, well, whatever, whatever. Once upon a time, there was real life as well. And that doesn't always look like a fairy tale. And that's okay. But after the ten of uh, wands, you also have the ace of wands. So they have the, f the fire in the belly, the desire to start something fresh. They also can have an idea of new business they want to pursue and, you know, offer you a potential um, position there in their business as well. Yes, there was definitely somebody else. And now they know as well that um, it's time to get to the next level. It's time to meet up, have a gathering with you. And there's a joy at the end, you know. It's not something that's going to be... Um, painful is actually a release. It's going to be like, let's celebrate our reconnection. 
because that's what they want at the end of the day, right? They were limiting themselves in the mind. They, they look up to you thinking that it's not, you know, possible. It's never going to happen to me. They were watching you from afar, but holding on to their money and to what they knew. But maybe what they knew wasn't what they thought it was. They became an emperor. Boom, bada, boom. And that's why the chariot is very often uh, associated to the energy of the emperor because that is a movement forward. You know, it's rushing towards you and they want victory. When the emperor knows what they want and who they want, nothing, nothing can stop them. And they know what they want. And also because, you know, what else do you want? Emperor, empress, they know you are a match. Okay. So how they feel, they feel very determined to move towards you but also a bit fearful because they don't know how you're going to react. Okay, so part number two, how do they feel? Six of pentacles, four of sword, ten of pentacles. Oh my goodness, this is powerful. So yes, uh, six of pentacles, they want equal give and take with you. They definitely want to treat you the way you deserve because maybe they haven't done that in the past. They really want to offer you everything they can because they recognize you as the equal. There's a lot of idea of equality here. Very important. So definitely healing happened. They were probably opposed between you two for a while because you both needed to look within, heal the inner child, go back to, you know, the 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 pre, the primary trauma in life and sort it out um but that pose was very important because you you needed to really clarify what belonged to you and what belonged to them as well uh yes with the ten of pentacles it's an idea of recognizing each other have a pose for a while a separation in order to become the best version of yourself separately and then come back together but this time at the best version of yourself so then you become a power couple a powerhouse and there's a lot of success and abundance so it's absolutely stunning really beautiful but it's very equal that's very important for them yes you meant to be there now no they needed to balance their emotion they needed to do the healing and you as well so now you're in a better place and this idea of equilibrium is very much similar to this balancing 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 the scales had to be really the same yes there's a nostalgia of each other nostalgia of pure love as well maybe you were both in a different relationship and realized that was not pure love that was um you know um yeah that was the wrong timing as well now the timing is correct that's the thing you need to you needed to do the homework both of you you needed to appreciate maybe you were with a karmic relationship and that was what you thought was love but actually it wasn't and now you realize and you've done the homework therefore the universe give you that gift you know well done you you've done the work now you have the result absolutely magician totally they were leaving or both of you were living in an illusion and now you realize you're manifesting each other because you are the true love beautiful and the, you know the magician is a very strong emotion a movement forward very strong hmm yeah <laughs> No, we don't like that one, do we? Page of Wands, yes, they were trying maybe to keep things under the carpet, you know, not facing the truth, not facing themselves, maybe being a bit flirty uh, here and there, flirtatious, I should say. But it wasn't, you know, that was not enough to nourish them, okay? So they knew that was not the right things. Mm -hmm. There's an, a desire, first of all, a lot of attraction, but also um, more than the chemistry, there's a desire to make it work and the fire in the belly to make it happen. So how they feel is they want to create a balance between you two. They know that you both had to meet, to manifest each other, to realize they were actually leaving an illusion and do the homework to create the proper relationship, the balanced relationship, which is true love beautiful loving the reading today absolutely stunning on this note have a beautiful day and i see you tomorrow Mwah. ciao